All right, guys. So if anybody ever just bought the Honda EU 2200i or EU 2200i with Co-Minder, and it's new, and you got that rough idle on eco mode with no load on it, or even with a load on it, there is a fix for that, and it's got nothing to do with the carburetor. You know, I'm not talking about surging. I'm talking about just a choppy rough idle. You know. So here's a couple fixes. Right off the bat, when I fired up mine, <clears throat> I've got about a half an hour to 40 minutes on this one. Had that rough idle irritating me to death. I'm trying to figure out what it could be. So I pulled the spark plug. And if you look here in the manual. The spark plug gap is listed as, you know, 0.024 to 0.028, which is 0 0.6 to 0.7 millimeter. Right off the bat, when I pulled out the factory plug, I noticed it was crushed right in pretty good. So rather than do it with a, a dial one you would get from the auto parts store, a gapper, you know, you use feeler gauges <clears throat> if you want to get this right the first time. So what I noticed on this engine with the stock NGK plug is it was it was so far in guys, it was ridiculous. And it was nowhere near spec. And if I remember correctly when I gapped it, it was like <laughs> at least at least 020021 it was ridiculous so what I did was I gapped this thing um, I gapped it to 024 and what a difference it made it immediately idled on eco mode flawlessly I couldn't believe it so now that it's properly gapped you know it, it idles perfectly the other fix that you can do, or up, call it an upgrade, is you can get this. This is an NGK Iridium, a real one. Okay, you get them right from NGK if you want. Shipping's a little high, but you can get them. So there's the model number. That's the CR5HIX7120. It does not come with the cap. So I bought a cheapo spark plug that does have a cap, and I'm going to put it on here. Okay. So I've gapped it right to the book. I gapped this iridium plug right at the bottom spec, first one, 0.024. So to do that, the truth is it was pretty much right there out of the box. I didn't have to do anything to it. So I actually went in between. It's like a 0.63 millimeter. Okay. So when you do these iridiums, you got to be careful. You, you don't be rough on them. You don't bend them up with a screwdriver or anything like that. You just you move this appropriately if you need to electrode is in there. It's, just be careful. I slide it in from the side. This is an 025. I slide it in from the side and make sure that it's nice and smooth. Okay? Because you don't want to do it to the point where you're gouging the electrode or getting it all dirty. You don't want to do that either. So you just put it in there, make sure the feeler gauges are clean. You don't want to get all greasy up in there. That's all it needs to be. You don't want it over, you don't want it grabbing, you don't want any friction. You just want to know it's there and there's no play. 
You know, if it's like throwing a hot dog down a hallway, you don't want that either. You just kind of want it, I don't know if you can see that. You want it to be able to slide in and out of there without any play. And you're done. And I did the same thing on the stock NGK, and what a difference it made. The engine ran perfect, I couldn't believe it. And um, <clears throat> at first I was ready to box it right back up and just bring it right back. I was so aggravated with it. I didn't feel like I should need to operate on a new engine or let these let anybody else operate on it either. So that's what I did. And um, I will fire the engine for you so you can hear the idle. How smooth it is. So this is with a proper spark plug gapping at .024 on this NGK stock plug that they use. Then I'm going to take it out and put the other iridium in there and see the difference. even warmed up fully and I put it on eco mode and guys I don't know if you can tell in the camera but it just idles perfectly there's no there's no missing there's no coughing hesitating there's nothing it basically cleaned it right up just by gapping the spark plug to the proper setting Before the engine gets hot, I'm going to change this plug and put the iridium plug in it. Okay guys, so look, I went to uh, the auto parts store and I just bought some, you know, plain Jane old plug for a car. I'll, give, I'll tell you what it was here in a minute. This is just some auto light plug. This says number 64 on it. There's literally no information on it otherwise. Right? I just, I'm after this. This piece. This is all I needed. This was $2.37. If you buy this piece from anywhere else, you know, the thing's like five, six, seven, eight dollars. How ridiculous. Right? So. It's gonna cost you two and a half. It's gonna cost you two bucks, three bucks to get this cap along with this plug. Right. So I'm gonna put this on here. factory plug out I don't have a torque wrench here so when I read this is the stock plug this is a CR5 HSB NGK this is the one that came out of it okay this plug has a, a half an hour time this engine this uh, generator has a half an hour on it okay plug is, in my opinion, it's a little wet. Um, like I said, this thing was pushed so far in it was ridiculous. I, can't, I couldn't even believe it ran. Now I'm going to put it, you know, it's at, eight, it's at 024. This one, actually, 024, 025, which is fine. 024 to 028, 0.6 6 to 0.7 mil, I think it was. But you get the picture. It ran so much better at an 024, 025, like the, like the manual says, that I couldn't even believe it. I didn't think it was going to fix it. I didn't think it was going to, I didn't think it was going to matter. But it did. 
they cleaned it right up immediately. So I have not tried this plug yet, but I can tell you right now, as a Honda guy, I got a few different engines, a few different generators, a few different toys, tools. I put this in all of them pretty much. But you won't find it most likely around your local auto parts place or at your local dealer that sells power equipment. They should have them on the wall in every Honda dealer across the country, but they don't. They don't seem to for some reason. And they make it difficult to get them.